What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. Remember the video I did where I used AI to create the most powerful vehicle for me in Crossout? Well, that didn't really work out. Now, Crossout itself does have an auto assembly feature. I'm pretty sure none of you guys know this feature is here. Well, some of you guys do, the older players, but the new players probably don't know this. This button right here is a vehicle auto assembly with parts from the storage. Now, you guys always told me that, JB, you have a promo account. You have everything in the game. Why don't you use this feature more often? Well, because it usually gives me a bunch of junk. So in today's video, we're going to try and use a build from the auto assembly. And if it doesn't work out, we're going to improve on it every single match. So that's the plan. So uh, let's just fire it up and see what we get. Also, before we do that, I get three tries because sometimes it just really gives me jump. So I got three tries to find something good and just keep going and stick it with it for the video. All right, here it goes. Interesting, interesting. Doesn't look too bad. Doesn't look too bad. We're actually going to keep this one. Let's save it over here. And let's see if we can find something better, though. Uh, yes. Okay. Oh, that one looks... See, like something like this, bro. Like, what am I supposed to do with this thing? Okay, let's uh, let's do it one more time. Bro, the, the porcupine can't even... <laughs> I mean, I can't improve on it, but this is just an awful build. I think I'm gonna stick with this one, though. This one looks interesting. What kind of cabin? What the power score? 6 key power score? Not so bad. Oh, we're using the werewolf cabin. Oh, that's great. So that means we get to see the new perk. All right, excellent. We're sticking with this one. I can already see a few changes I want to implement. All right, well, just uh, we'll just wing it and see. We are going to use a co-driver, though. Grizzly, oh, it already automatically gives you a co-driver. All right, here we go. All right, we are at Old Town, and I'm going to be honest. This is the most competent build the Crossout Auto Assembler has ever made for me. It actually looks like a real build. So let's see if it works out. It has a gas generator, which is probably one of the biggest issues that I uh, I see. The wheels are, I believe, the, the blue wheels, the buggy wheels. Oh, it's not the buggy wheels. It's a different name. I never used that wheel, so that's why I don't know the name of it. Um, there was someone over here. Let's actually help out with a bot first. There we go. I see the generator in the back. There we go. Let's pop it. Oh, we shot it off. Interesting. Yeah, the controllability of this build is not the greatest. It keeps sliding left and right. I think the, the weight is off balance. Dude, I was not trying to block you. I was genuinely trying to help you. Wow. So this build cannot even take care of one single bot. Okay, that, that's just rude, dude. That is just rude. I'll let you take care of it, though. I'll just sit in the back and uh, do my best. I'm still going to steal your kill, though. <laughs> oh, it's the last guy, so yeah, that's fine. Oh, I, I took uh, All good, all good, all good. All good. All good, man, all good. All right, so this build had some issues with the driving. Driving felt really off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put non-steering like the studded wheels, yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put non-steerings in the back because that was the main issue. So let's just fix one issue at the time. Uh, let's use array wheels. Array wheels, oh, they don't even fit. Okay. So I do want to use array wheels. So I'll make this one a little bit bigger. I think I need to use a 2x4. I need to use a 2x6. Sorry, not a 2x4. Now the array wheels should fit. There we go. Perfect. We're going to do the same thing for the front if we can. There we go. The front ones do fit immediately. That's actually great. Actually, I want the wheels to be on the same. Uh, I want the build to be the same width. So let's add another structural part there so our wheels can stick out just a little bit more. All right. There it looks better already. I think this should be fine. Hopefully that helps with this too. All right. Let's try again. All right, guys. Welcome to the orbital station. I saw a lot of action here, so I'm just going to join the party. All right. Oh, 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 that looks like another goblin type build. Mm. Steering feels a lot better on this build now. I do like that. So just a small change and the build already feels a lot better. Now, this guy might be an issue here. Let's uh, go up here. Yeah, that build is uh, he, luckily he isn't. Oh, luckily he isn't the fastest, so we can uh, we can outrun him a little bit. There we go. We can mess him up now. There we go. Beautiful. 
That's actually pretty good. Let's focus on this guy next. It's a bot, but it's okay. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, is that... Oh, crap. All right. Let's try again. That was actually pretty good. All right, guys. We're at the bridge this time. Uh, we got a few bots here, which I'm just going to get rid of quickly. can't believe that just switching wheels makes such a big difference. I don't think anybody uses the studded wheels anymore. Uh, we are under the... There's someone on our cap. Interesting. Uh, let's uh, go investigate who that is. Yep, I'm going. I'm going with you. Dude, by the way, guys, dude, last time on stream, I played a little bit of Daisy and I'm playing Cross Out and oh my god, hold on. I just got the urge to play Daisy again. Oh my god. Whoa. Holy crap. So, Worlds at what? 7k par score is really powerful. He just pushed me away like I was nobody. But yeah, I just got the urge to play Daisy again, man. Damn, that sucks. <laughs> like, Daisy was one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, I am struggling a little bit, so that's why I'm doing a little story time. But yeah, if you guys want to see some DayZ, I might eventually play it on a second channel, because I don't think anybody's going to watch it on this one. Um, I'm actually going to go to the cap. If you can destroy me, that's fine, because we have a werewolf cabin, which should give us a little... Oh my god, dude. Whoa. There's like nothing I can do. He just pushes me away. That is crazy. Yeah, get him, get him. That is insane, though. There we go. We got some range. Oh, no, dude. We were so, we were doing so fine. Yeah, there we go. Get him. Huh. It's like... I don't know why they stopped shooting me. It's like, like just, just finish me off, guys. <laughs> uh, we might still lose. Oh, actually, we could win. We can win this. We can win this. Uh, there we go. We just won. Uh, not the most exciting match. At least you get story time of Daisy. Okay, so there was nothing wrong with this build, but I do want to try and improve it a little bit. We're using a gas generator. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove that. I'm actually going to use a P1 charge generator over here. And then have just one single RNC radiator. I think that should be enough. We're going to replace the bumper in the front for a... Well, let's see if the Gazan bumper works. The Gazan is pretty big. It doesn't look as pretty anymore. Let's use something smaller. There we go. That bumper looks better. For the gun mounts, I flip these two around so we can actually do this. We'll just have four in the middle and let's just all put them together. Yeah, something like this. Let's actually move this one a little bit to the back. And I think we are good to go. I am going to add a hardcore engine. I think, you know, just for fun. I don't think it has one yet. Yep, there we go. So now our cabin is a little bit protected from the back. So I just realized this thing still has three energy to spur. I'm not sure why it had a generator to begin with. So what I'm going to do is actually going to use another goblin. So now we have six goblins and we actually have room for another radiator. So we're just going to add this one back. Parts limits reach. Okay, we're going to remove these. Uh, let's see what we can remove here. Oh, we'll, we'll, we'll remove the lights. We don't need the lights. And that should increase our bar score. You know, actually, it's pretty similar. So we got two radiators, one P1 charge generator. We got a hardcore engine and six goblin shotguns. I think this build is looking pretty good already. It's not the most effective, but it looks okay. I don't know why we have an open window here. <laughs> All right, guys, welcome to Sector X. So our build got improved quite a lot. We got two radiators and everything is well put well together. Hold on. We are getting shot from the side here. So let's try to go here. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, let's hide from the bots. Yeah, see that? We lost a couple of armor panels, but uh, you know, that's fine. Uh, let's keep pushing. Mm, let's go for Sergey. Sergey is a laser build. Blockchain, actually. There we go. Beautiful. That was nice and quick. Let's fall back again. Oh, wait, there is like uh, art here. Merry Christmas. Oh, that's cool. I did not know that. That's actually kind of cool. So right now we're going up against a world build that went actually pretty good. Oh, we got to back it up. This build has way too much pushing power because of the tracks. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, we got this arm. Mm, all right. Looks like it's time for another improvement. Actually, let's go. Let's go attack this guy. Let's see. Let's SD on him and let's see what the little werewolf drone looks like. Let's get a good shot under him. There we go. 
Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Get stuck. Oh, no. Oh, hey. Oh. <laughs> Dude, this thing is OP. The fact that you don't have a timer. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. I wonder if you get destroyed. If you. Oh, yeah, you do have, I believe, 400 durability. And we rammed them, so we did lose a little bit of health. I don't think he. he I think he. I think he thinks that I will detonate automatically after a while. Oh my god, this thing is disgusting. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Why are you SDing here? Oh, he's the last guy. Oh my god, I got MVP with my little drone! <laughs> Dude! Oh, please, please, Des, please don't change this. This is really fun. All right, so that was good. The only issue we had is our guns got shot off really quick. I don't think we can really fix that unless we add some kind of bumper. Yeah, we're just going to use the off-road bumper there just to protect our top guns a little bit. The bottom ones eh, kind of need protecting as well. I think I'm going to remove the mud flaps. I'm actually going to put them one square above. So we still have mud flaps but it's a bit hot. Oh, actually that works out, I guess. All right. So now we can still add another bumper over here. And let's add this one again, the spiky one. There we go. There we go. That should help out a little bit. And we're still under 7K. All right, guys, welcome to the orbital station. Did I just see a fluid? <laughs> Looks like I inspired someone to use the flutes. I am. Uh, I was going to say I'm approaching the bots alone, which is probably not the smartest thing to do. But we got one disabled, sort of, kind of. Oh, my God. This guy just came in and ruined my fun. He has a lot of pushing power. Why is he? Why does he have so much pushing power? Holy crap. My build held up, though against a quad is it a quad i think a triple piercer build that's fine i hope we can get our oh it's a equalizer build there we go yeah there we go that's fine dude that's fine oh man i wish i could get my revenge dude that's like the worst thing ever someone destroys you and then you pay back with destroying or by destroying them with the little drone thing oh <laughs> oh this is cool Oh, this is awesome. Oh, no. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, the kryptonite is the bots, though, with their god aim. Oh, my God. That was hilarious. Let's do one more quickly. That explosion is actually really well done. I wish we had more of those uh, environmental destruction in the game. But yeah, guys, welcome to the Nameless Tower. This build is actually turning out to be really fun, man. I'm really enjoying this one. Um, David, man. let's go for David real quick. Hopefully it's a quick destruction. Not really. Uh, this guy's pushing up. I am getting back up, so that's good. There we go. Finish off this synthesis guy and whoa. Oh, Abigail doing some. Oh, it's a. Oh, okay. I see what's happening here. Uh, there's a dust player here as well with. Yeah, well. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about a Tusk player, so that kind of sucks. Luckily, we have this thing, though. Uh, this guy keeps shooting me. He knows what's up. Oh, man, dude. Freaking cat, dude. Oh, my God. And really, if I got a genie in a bottle and he gave me three wishes, I would wish for Cap Cans to just disappear from Crossout. For reals. Probably one of the most annoying things ever added. All right, guys, welcome to the Broken Arrow. Let's try that again. Hopefully, no cap can users. Uh, ooh, that's a ooh, triple Aurora. That's a nasty build. Uh, Florence is here, luckily. So let's finish off. Whoa! It always surprised me to see a Tina bot in the in the game at this bar score. Please don't don't hit me like that, my guy. Oh my god. Oh rip. Uh, let's finish off this bot. Uh, uh, yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Uh, there was someone. Yeah, the Aurora belt is kind of dangerous. Uh, let's fall back for now. There we go. Oh my god, this ram actually hurt his leg. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, wow, that's a GG. This build is actually pretty good. The only thing it's weak against it's Capcans. Oh, or, or that thing. Hold on, boys. 
no, never mind. Kaiju will be destroyed soon. There we go, beautiful. Here we go. Yeah, dude, this AI thing, Crossout Auto Builder, actually gave me a pretty competent build. With some slight modifications, of course. Well, guys, there you have it. This build was actually super duper fun and effective. The modifications I made made it a little bit better, and it still looks good. What's our durability? 1777. Not bad. Not bad at all. I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, I hope I earned your subscription. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Peace!